Austin, Texas bomber Mark Condit and Beaver Dam explosives maker Benjamin Morrow. Both white males in their 20s. Both had mothers with Midwestern roots. Both conservative Christian and both homeschooled. Both made homemade explosives and blew themselves up. Their motives? Both unknown. Right now, the similarities in the two suspects are merely coincidence, and law enforcement says no conclusions should be drawn. Investigators focus on the individual behavior, not the demographics. We are the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms, and Explosives, and we both investigate and regulate. Joel Lee is ATF's lead agent in Milwaukee. And while he wouldn't comment on the specifics of any case, I asked him what will help find potential bombers sooner. If someone is um, handling or, or doing something that seems out of the ordinary with explosives materials or, or anything of that nature, but if it's to the point that it would pique someone's suspicions, if you see something, say something. And federal agents say what we've learned is a potential bomber could be anyone, anywhere, the FBI in Texas Patrick and Toy wouldn't comment on the similarities. And we know what's similar or the same in these cases, but what do we know that's different? Well, the Texas bomber, Condit, killed people before intentionally killing himself. The Beaver Dam suspect, Moro, never injured anyone else and apparently accidentally killed himself. Mm -hmm. Also, Moro had a chemistry background and Condit took business classes. We're still left with the question, why was Ben Moro making all those explosives in Beaver Dam? All right. Thank you, Terry.